Well, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, wherever you're watching this from. Thank you very much for joining me. I have not been on my park bench video platform for a while. No excuse, my fault. Can't say it's about Corona. It just means I've been lazy. But today I have the fortunate opportunity to interview one of my great agents who's an up and coming rising star here in the real estate space. Before I introduce you to him, he's made the whole journey from Africa, also known as a, a country named Ghana, great soccer country. We've had some friends that I've played soccer with over the years from there. And uh, one of the reasons why I think we connected when we first met each other over at a, um, oh, what I put on? I put on an amazing uh, presentation on send out cards in Waltham a year ago, maybe uh, 14, 18 months ago. And here he is coming back into my life, signed up for send out cards, is just a, a real cool cat. And uh, let me let me introduce you, my good friend, Augustine Asua, all the way from uh, Kenya, at my fault, Ghana, here in Africa, now makes its way in Drake, Massachusetts, and is crushing the marketplace in Worcester. Welcome aboard, sir. Hi, Jay. Thank you for having me. How are you? Good, good. Well, Augustine doesn't have as many words as I do, but that's going to change. He's going to become a video guru. But the reason for us getting together today on this Zoom call here at Park Bench is to open up some uh, ideas for people who are looking for real estate, who uh, would love to work with someone who can speak their native language, who they can trust, like, have a relationship with. And a lot of those uh, folks are moving out to the Worcester area, the 495 belt, and lo and behold, we've come across the gentleman that can service those clients. So tell us a little bit about your passion, Augustine, in the real estate space and, and who we can help refer you business out in the Worcester, 495, Lemonster, Lowell, all the way out uh, as far as the Boston area to help them with their 1031 exchanges, the real estate purchases, or just simply some real estate advice. Hi, uh, Jay, thank you for having me. Uh, it's nice uh, uh, to be with you today. Uh, I'm very uh, excited to be on this uh, call. Yes, yeah, so I'm in mean, a uh, real estate business. I've been, uh, I started about three years ago and I'm servicing people around Lower uh, Chancellor Drake and uh, Worcester area. I mean, Worcester is a big community for uh, African, especially uh, Ghanaians uh, uh, there a lot. And uh, that is where I want to uh, be uh, to help all those who need uh, in need of real estate, uh, buying and selling, and also uh, commercial real estate. Excellent, excellent. Uh, and as as we're going through the the real estate uh, curve, as you know, there's ups and downs. You've been mentored by a couple of my agents as well as some great vendors in the area. And I know that you want to build your own video platform, which I'm going to help you with over the next few weeks which I commend you. Most of the things that we're, we're doing here, here at Park Bench is to let community business owners who might be affected, who are affected by this thing called the corona, how we can help get their message out by interviewing them and putting it on our social media platforms, et cetera. Certainly a lot less expensive than buying a Facebook ad or buying some media blitz uh, that's one and done. We want to build relationships with folks, the small business owners, the restaurant owners, the electricians, the plumbers, the, the folks that might have a passion in something called football, our sport, soccer. We love soccer. Me and this yes, I do. Yeah. So in, in that regard, tell me a little bit more about uh, a story. Uh, let's talk about the, an upcoming closing that you and John Crandall have. Tell me about that and how wonderful you got that guy guys home under agreement and what you can do from there. Oh, okay. So yeah, um, we had a, a seller who contacted me, uh, somebody in my uh, community. So, and I had John on board. Uh, he's my business partner in the office. He's my friend, great guy. So John and I had um, the, we listed and um, the open house, we, uh, the second day, we just had uh, a buyer and we put uh, the house on agreement and the agreement within the, I think, the second day of the open house. So since then, it was a great buyer. He had uh, pre-approved, we had 20% down payment. Uh, 
you know, wave and inspection and stuff like that. So, so far, everything is going great. I'm, um, my co-broker, uh, Bunto, is also a wonderful guy. Uh, we've been uh, talking almost uh, every day and everything is going smooth. I love it. I love it. Now, full disclosure, this cat listens to me. He signed up for things called send out cards. He's already sent the co-broke a thank you card and a gift. How many other brokers that you know, 30 years in my business, have done that? I can count them on a hand. None. You know, this cat is selling from the heart right there. My good friend, Larry Levine, a little plug for Larry Levine. He wrote this book. I recommend everybody uh, receive one. And if you like, drop some comments below and we'll pick uh, a winner and I'll get you out a copy of that uh, today. So congratulations, Augustine. I think uh, you're on the right track. I mean, people count numbers don't. When you focus on people, you'll have an infinite amount of business. When you focus on numbers, what's the cost, Jay? What's the return on my investment, Jay? How can you guarantee me I get this, Jay? <laughs> we, we just do what? We just kick them to the curb. We tell them to go to our competition. We tell them to get out of the industry. We go, tell them to go to work at Walmart. You know? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> anyhow. Anyhow, I'll tell you this, though. You know, you socked it out of the park today. You're going to be getting one of these pairs of socks. I love to tell people I bought $10,000 worth of these things. People say I'm nuts, but guess what? You socked it out of the park. Wear these with pride. And I thank you for being part of our community here at Leia Realty Partners. See, folks, you can't keep your first communion, your, your first confirmation, your bar mitzvah money, your first marriage, your second marriage, or your third marriage. You can't keep that money right? And expect it to work for you. You got to push it out. As my good friend Grant Cardone right here, 10 x it. you got to spend money to make money, but you got to spend it in the right area, the right That's quadrants. True. And when you spend it on people, hmm, people will have an infinite amount of resources to give back to you in a kind, um, profitable, uh, positive way instead of the knickknack negative that you're seeing out there with all the BS crap. You, you have heard that we haven't talked about sex, politics, uh, other stuff that is just toxic out there. What we do talk about is this cat helping somebody sell their home so they can get down to Florida to spend more time with their family. Now that's a good story. Um, before we end, uh, oh God, we've got a few more minutes. Luckily, <laughs> I had the sure. extra time for you, Mike. My good friend. So tell me a little bit about yourself. Let's let's go into that. Why would anybody want to hire you as a buyer's agent or as a seller's agent uh, to put their biggest purchase or their biggest sale uh, with you in, in, in good hands? Tell me, tell us a little bit about that. Uh, so yeah, Jay, I been doing this for the past three years. Um, I have great um, team that I work with who have over 30 something years of experience. I have a, a great team with a great rested agent. And um, um, <laughs> and, I, and I'm very passionate about what, what I'm, I do here. I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm happy when my clients are happy. So uh, that's why I go out every day and look for people to help, you know, to move them into their dream house uh, or those who want to sell, to help them sell and get their dream house. Or if they just want to go and rent, I'll help them. I'm just happy when I see people happy, you know, in this real estate uh, area. I like it. I like it. As you can see down, I think the audience can see, I have my name, J McHugh, S-O-C slash 10X. I see your name, Gifty. Uso, is Gifty your nickname? My, my wife. <laughs> oh, so that's your wife. Okay, cool. cool. Well, we should have her on this call too, shouldn't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's probably the boss, right? You know who yeah, my boss yeah. is. Yeah, we've she already is, talked yeah. about that. We got, a, we got a picture of my boss. Oh, there she is, right there. Oh, no, I mean yeah. right there. there your there you boss, go. yeah. Right, you know? <laughs> See, there's a better way, you know? Look at that right there, you know? Yeah. yeah you sent me this card and I loved it. You scrubbed this picture off the internet years ago. He knows I'm passionate about my two dogs. They're in the dog pen because I he stole the turkey one day. And, uh, you know, he's telling me there's a better way. You know, this cat gets it. For three years in the business, he listens to the people who made the mistakes like me before 
him. And then he puts those uh, wonderful things into action. As I say, he plant, he waters the plants and he does not water the weeds. We have this thing I teach in front of two or 2,000 people that at times when people throw a sprinkler on, they really don't know that they're watering the plants with their resources called the water. And they're also watering with their resources. The yeah, yeah. The weeds. And they don't understand why they're not getting what they're, they're looking for. And when you stop and think and you focus just on the plant, the screaming, raving fan, and you stay away from the weeds, you know, those leads that come in that are nothing but weeds that you spend 38.5% to give off to some third party moron system. <laughs> no wonder why you have no money to reflect back on the plants. Sure. This cat, three years in the business, he understands the difference quickly where we have people 30 years in the business still watering the weeds. Well, this has been awesome. This has been awesome. Who's calling me right now? We've got a little live going on and people are complimenting you right now. They know you You might be a little nervous. I don't think you're a little nervous. I think you're going to be a superstar on this platform. So before we end, uh, what would you like to do? Happy Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa, happy Merry Christmas, happy New Year, upcoming Martin Luther King. I know you're going to get cards out to all of those close yeah. friends and relatives who, as I say, the audience is how you deliver your message. Know your sure. audience and then deliver the message uh, specifically. We talked earlier before coming live on this. To be terrific, you must be specific. You're not a global real estate that can help everybody globally, 7.2 billion people. No. Who'd want to work? You're a specific 1031 exchange buyer agent, listing agent here in the Worcester, Lower Lawrence, Chelmsford area that speaks multiple languages, that has trust as high as anybody, work ethic as high as anybody and a dog attitude of getting you the result that you're looking for. And I applaud you, my friend. How, how can people get in touch with you? Give me your email, your cell number, uh, even your home address if someone wants to send you a card. Yeah, so yeah, I live um, in Drake, Massachusetts, uh, 227 Hebrew Street on Drake. I work in Chelmsford. I'm affiliated in the Chelmsford office of Leah Race. It is 173 Chelmsford Street in Chelmsford. Uh, my phone number is 978-606-3270. My email is aosu at leahrealty.com. Uh, you can find me in Facebook, Augustine Ousu, my business pages, uh, Augustine Ousu, my African friends and uh, people from Ghana. Uh, check me on Facebook. Uh, I'm also on uh, Twitter and um Instagram, I uh, can find me all there. Wow, wow, that's awesome, man! You, you're certainly, uh, you know, towing the hard work. You're gonna have great results in 2021. I'm here to help any way I can, coaching you, uh, suggesting for you, uh, participating in whatever you might need. So, therefore, my gift to you is to see you have massive success, 10x success in 2021. Thank you very much, folks. We're gonna close it right now. I'm gonna. Give Augustine the last word. I'm going to wish you all a Merry Christmas, a Happy Hanukkah coming up, and uh, a wonderful, safe New Year, Kwanzaa as well. And uh, if, if you don't believe in any of the faith, just have a great day this day. Be safe, be kind. Take it away, Augustine, and then we'll close it up. Thank you, all uh, uh, friends who are watching uh, live from Facebook. Uh, Jay is a great friend of mine, a mentor. He's been coaching me since I came here. I mean, he's one of those people that I I've come to trust and I uh, respect. Um, he's a great guy, great business uh, partner, and I'm happy uh, that I have him uh, as my mentor. Uh, on these uh, coming holidays, I wish everybody a happy Hanukkah, Christmas. You have a wonderful uh, rest of the day. Thank you. You have a good day. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye now.